YouTube family. Maverick still on the space, you know. Yeah, man. Yeah, and guess what? <laughs> and the World Championship Chronicles, you know. Yeah, man. And by the way, if you don't see me have moved today, you know, I'm going to move. So, i do this while I move. But I get a call today. No, in and out, no. I made a call. I get a message. And as a result of the message, I made a call. It's not Nigel Clark, I call this time. <laughs> but I call Coach Maurice Wilson. He's actually the technical leader of the, the Jamaica team. Look at Budapest. And can I tell you, everybody say Coach Maurice Wilson when he does interviews, he's a part of TVJ, track and field analyst team and all of them. So normally quiet the be the composed and all of them. So but but Willow was livid. Willow was livid at me. Yeah man. And Mr. said, what, no, what, what we do now, Willow come. Since me post up the video about the mix with him, I you know talk what, what caused this. If say boy that 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 video where you do about the mix release. Of course, how about kid of the Jamaica camp? He said, what do you mean? He said, boy, the thing where you say, you insinuate, say, he, Coach Morris Wilson, has something to do with the selection of the teams. First thing he pointed out to me. Because remember, I said, this video was about the, 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 that embarrassing performance on the mixed relay team, you know. You know, the first, the first relay team, Jamaica relay team, run out of the heat. And everybody living about it, including me. And in the video now, me not talk so well then. Some of them athletes are when them have a run the mixed relay team. They pass them best and they don't deserve a run for Jamaica. And we did point out the facts that one of them athletes here, which is one of them athletes eh, connected to Willow because I'm my coach. Alright. So all of that get Willow living now. I'm saying this is a cause, you know, cause a, a, kind of aspirations over my integrity. So the first thing Willow sought to clarify, and he said emphatically, is that he, Coach Wilson, as a technical leader on these teams, he not have no direct involvement in the selection and placement of teams. Now that came as a surprise to me. I mean, never know that. Me assume said the nature of being a technical leader, and then kind of decision there, you have the final word part. So Willow, if I assume that you as the technical leader had some kind of influence on the selection of the team. My apologies to you, my boss. See? I never knew that. I made the assumption that the technical leader had some kind of say in the selection of the team. Especially knowing Coach Wilson's sound technical background as a successful track and field coach. Anyway, so we we'll want we'll me ensure say everybody know. Say him have nothing for the setting up of the relay team. In fact, you know what I'm saying to myself? He said if he had anything to do with the setting up of that mixed relay team, it would have been set up differently. The phone nearly dropped when he said so. He said, what? I'm going to ask him, say, oh, you're in the camp and make them set up the mixed relay team against your will or against your approval and you make that go on. But he was so upset that we never bother put that forward to him. Anyway, he also went on to explain to me. I couldn't believe this. He said, the video, the Maverick video, a wreak havoc in the Jamaica camp in a Budapest. Like it a cause a rift and a division between his athletes when coach and the other athletes in the camp. I said, what? I said, you want me to take down the video, coach? He said, no, you don't have to do that, but you just need to address them issue. Yeah. I said, I'm going to take down the video, coach. If the video cause some problem, they can't. I don't want nothing in Jamaica camp, you know. And any kind of finger come on, come point on the Maverick or the work of the Maverick, you know. So I'm going to take down the video. He said, I'm not going to take down the video, but I'm going to take down the video. Although it gone out there already, but I'm going to take it down. Because he said, he's apparently now, he never said explicitly, you know. But he said, it's a cause a rift in the camp, affecting some of his athletes who him coach. Come remember, I said, all right, I, again, before I before continue to tell you what we just said. This is a lesson. This, this, there's a lesson to be learned by that experience, you know. Because you see what happened now? We always talk about conflict of interest in Jamaica. And what has happened is because Willow is the chair, the long time technical leader, most of them team ever go with the major championship here. And he's also the head of Sprint Tech. We have athletes for the team. 
So even if we don't know directly involved in the selection of teams, you know, you can see where the perception will be out in the public eye. So we don't have something to the selection of the team because the coaching team them and him also the head and the technical. What's it? The head, the technical leader of the team. So they must address that. We don't have to know how to maneuver himself around that. See, but he also went on to say that, look, you see them, because I mentioned it on the video, you know, the Fox and the World Championship pay money directly. It could conceivably be a motivational factor for the selection of certain athletes vis-a-vis -vis certain athletes. We don't upset about that. Because he said implicit in that is that he will is manipulating selection of teams, relay teams, because of the monetary, you know, the monetary thing at the end of the at the end of the channel. The monetary rewards at the end of the, the day. So he said that appeared a bad perception about him. I mean, I said, Willow, we don't mean to paint a bad perception about you as a, like a like an idle painter, you know? but a reality and facts. If you are the technical leader still, my boss, and you also coach, you have a you have a you have a track club, and you coach, and some of your athletes in the team, you can't stop. In fact, I actually said, in fact, what we said to Willow, we can move up a bit more. What in other traffic? What we said to Willow, say Willow, you know that this thing is abound in the track and field fraternity. Do if some people can chat, people can chat oral, people can chat, but you know, this is this furthest thing from the truth. It's a frank conversation, me and Willow have, you know. In fact, Willow sent me a message, people, on my phone. That's why he was so living, because he sent me a message on the phone. And we never respond till probably a day after, because my phone mash up. Yesterday, my phone mash up, you know. Me don't have no phone yesterday. Me never had a phone for about 10 hours. So he's ability, let me see the, the message when he sent me. So when me literally now get in touch with him now, he's living, because he sent me ignoring message. But we never ignore your message, you know. My phone mash up, man. My phone drop and mash up, so I couldn't see a message. It's a 165 WhatsApp message, me see. When we finally get my phone back up and running. Anyway, Willow went on to point out and said, Look here, Oral. This thing has cast a kind of shadow over his integrity. And he can't have that. Because he doesn't. He, he said, Chuck and Finn put him pot on fire. You know, I me not quote him, but he basically said, You know, this is a run down money. Where some people are insinuate. And where even situations like this might insinuate. He said he has his professional life outside of track and field. Because remember, Sir Willow is the principal of GC Fasta, you know, people. He is the principal of GC Fasta school. So he might, he might point out all of these to me. But the long and short of the thing is, Mr. Wills. If, if I did you harm, my boss, my apologies. I'm mean, going to take down the video. Can you see from you tell me say it a wreak havoc in the Jamaica camp? We can't take that from my conscience. Maverick like talk truth, you know, me like set the truth free, you know. But you, if you know me well, you know say me is a nationalist. I mean, I want nothing affect the morale and the vibe in the Jamaican camp. So I'm gonna take down the video and be a, be a, be a positiveness as the facts of Mr. Wilson asks me for state. So he does not play an active part. In the selection of these relay teams, he's the technical leader and the coaches for the respective teams pick them team and prepare them team. Him not have nothing to do with it. Him not, him not in a track and field to make money. So the notion that, that he's putting his athletes on teams to make money because of him coach them, he said that is false. He does not operate that way. He's a professional, he's in, and, and he's he's above that kind of behavior. So my, my, my apologies to Mr. Wills. See, it's a, but one thing me have to, you have to make me state again, no, Willow. You can't understand as a fear, man, that the conflict of interest perception will be there as long as you're an active coach of a track club. We have artists for the Jamaican national team and you're also the technical leader of the team. Boom! So me and Willow good. And it's same disappointed in me because me and him good. And me and him a friend. I'm going to call him Willow. I'm going to him good like that and him disappointed. But Willow. All right, let me put it this way. Everybody did gas up, you know, after that. After that race, you know. We were bitterly disappointed, you know. Bitterly, bitterly, bitterly disappointed. And that thing with your athletes in you know, the camp and you being the technical leader. How you going to escape from that, Willow? 
You don't want to know. Oh, you have to escape from it. Because this is something that is there, you know. It's like a man. It's like, like, like a man. is a technical leader of a, of a football, of, of the JFF. And him have a club. A few players are on the national team. People have always pointed to it, you know. Oh, by the way, there is such a man, you know. <laughs> anyway, we know. My apologies, my boss. I try to fix up the vibes in the camp. That's why we another video here. Yeah. I don't want to rift in the camp based on anything with the Maverick. See? At least to be able to self and stop pressure, we know, over the Maverick video. My apologies again to you, my boss. Bless up. Oh, we're from Budapest, me and you have a drink and talk it up. See, sir? See,